Guys, I feel like a total freaking douchebag right now. This is the worst I've ever felt about myself in a very, very, very long time. And I know you guys are probably going to give it to me in the comments and I deserve every bad name, you know, fat, piece of crap, homeless bum, the N-word, whatever you want to call me. So just by dumb luck, I'm finishing up a video that I got going in the same neighborhood where I went to that McDonald's to get some coffee. You remember when I did the, the phone call, when I called the McDonald's about that black kid, probably like 17, 18, 19 years old vaping. So just, dude, this is just by dumb luck. I come to this McDonald's. I never, ever planned to come back here ever, ever again. So just by dumb luck, I had to go back to the, whatever, to go finish the video. So I come back here and I'm like, all right, let me go get, just get a cup of coffee. And I go into the McDonald's and I hear the same voice. Like in the back, I hear the manager's voice. You know, it sounds like the gay white guy. So I said, let me, let me just go talk to him to see what happened. Right. And I said, and he, and this is all by dumb luck. So this guy, like the manager, he's like, uh, here's your coffee. And I said, Hey, I said, do you remember speaking to me about a week ago about a guy that was vaping in the back? And he goes, I, he said, yeah. And I said, like, whatever happened to that? And he said, well, we gave him a, a write up. And I said, he works here? And he's like, yeah. And I told him, I said, oh my God. I said, I feel like a piece of crap now. I didn't know he worked there. I just snitched on a guy that works at McDonald's. Oh my, I, I was like, man, I said, my bad. I said, I didn't know he worked there. And he's like, yeah, no, don't worry about it. You know, employees aren't supposed to be vaping while they're, you know, working at McDonald's. And I, I, I still felt really bad because I'm just like, man, I didn't mean, like, I don't call on employees. If an employee is doing a bad job, I don't call a complaint unless you're really doing a fucking bad job. Other than that, I never, ever call on an employee. I think it's very douchey. I think it's very crappy. And I just think only assholes do that. And I felt like such a scumbag because me, no, me personally, if I, like, he wasn't even wearing his uniform. He was wearing like a hoodie or something like that. I, I thought he was just some bum. Nah, the kid worked there, man. I feel bad. Man, that sucks. Dude, personally, I feel like, man, if you work at McDonald's, man, you should be able to do whatever the hell you want. If you want to go smoke crack while you're making my fish fillet, go right ahead. Who freaking cares? Ah, oh, man, I felt, I felt really bad. You know what I mean? But then on the other hand, you know, it's like, well, what the fuck are you doing vaping while you're at McDonald's? You know what I mean? It's... I don't know. I, I feel, I do still at the end of the day feel bad. I shouldn't have called, but I, I just thought I was some scumbag kid. I was like, dude, kick him out. Why he's big making, I don't know. Did I do the right thing? I, I feel like a scumbag. I, I, I don't know. Um, so if, if you're a, if you're a black teenager, uh, maybe at the oldest, you, you're probably not even 18 and, uh, you, you work in Kansas city at McDonald's. I'm the one that snitched on you. What you gonna do about it, nigga? Nothing at all. What you gonna do? You gonna see me? What you gonna do? Try, try to you know put your hands up and do it. Do you know how many weapons I got in my van, <laughs> dude? I dude, I can kill you with this crappy ass cell phone holder that I bought from Amazon that I can't even use because it's a piece of garbage. My coffee's good this time. termination.